Eucharistic Miracle, Place of the Miracle, Florence, Italy. Year of the Miracle, 1230. The miracle took place on December 30, 1230. A priest named Yugachoni, having finished celebrating Mass, did not realize that several drops of consecrated wine remained in the chalice and had turned into blood. The historian Giovanni Villani gives a precise description. A day later, taking up the chalice he found living blood coagulated and this was shown to all the women of the monastery, and to all the locals who were present and to the bishop and to all the clergy and then it was revealed to all the Florentines, who gathered with great devotion to see. He took the blood from the chalice and put it in a crystal cruet and again showed it to the population with great reverence. Bishop Ardingo of Pavia ordered that the reliquary be brought to him. He kept it for several weeks before returning it to the sisters of the monastery who took care of it near the church of St. Ambrose. Pope Boniface IX, in 1399, granted the same indulgence as the Portiuncula to those faithful who visited the church of St. Ambrose and contributed to adorning the reliquary of the miracle. The 750th anniversary of the miracle was celebrated in 1980. The reliquary, several drops of blood that measure about a square centimeter, is conserved in a reliquary which has been placed inside a white marble tabernacle constructed by Mimo da Fiesole.